20 minutes to do seven setup. Let's move. Day two, uni life. Uh, I've just had to walk off the set. Why I walked off the set was I felt that I wasn't getting the coverage that I need for the edit. And um, I'd spent some time talking with our director and uh, he's a competent director, but I think there's a bit of communication breakdown between what I require as the showrunner, what, what coverage I need uh, to do this series. And what I discovered, I went onto the set. I'm the producer showrunner, I'm not the director. And I started to break protocol and etiquette by ex trying to explain to the director in front of everybody. I knew that I needed to stop that, um, but I wasn't getting what I required. And I don't think he understood. He wasn't doing anything on purpose. He just, he just a lack of communication. I like the shot. Uh, Peggy, move slightly. Yes, but let's move Peggy a little bit. Every episode ends on a cliffhanger. All the characters have been introduced mostly, and now we discover the essence, the theme, and the plot line of the whole series, which is basically a who done it, who killed Aisha. And we are going to be exploring that as we go through the series. So my hope is that um, after our meeting tomorrow, everybody will get back onto sync and nobody will now go off the ATEM. Yeah, I don't think he understood the importance of that. So filming is stressful, um, but the person at the head, the arrowhead, can't, we can't lose, I can't lose my temper. I don't have that luxury. I just need to communicate. Uni life. Day two, I got pissed off. Welcome to filmmaking. I didn't lose my temper. I counted to 10 and I took a walk. The sun will rise tomorrow. It's not a life or death matter. We're making a series. We're not doing open heart surgery. No need to lose temper. We'll get back on track.